Well, the brakes might be put on confirmation vote for the Supreme Court nominee, Judge Brett Kavanaugh, hmm. after a woman came forward accusing the judge of sexual assault more than 30 years ago. Fox News correspondent Doug McElway has more from Washington. Judge Kavanaugh is one of the finest people that I've ever known. I wish the Democrats could have done this a lot sooner because they had this information for many months and they shouldn't have waited till literally the last days. She should not be ignored. She should not be insulted. She should be heard, but so should he. Supreme Court nominee Judge Brett Kavanaugh saying he's willing to appear before the Senate Judiciary Committee to defend himself against allegations of sexual assault. This coming after the White House says the committee is leaning towards inviting Kavanaugh's accuser to testify on Capitol Hill. Christine Blasey Ford accusing Kavanaugh of pinning her to a bed during a house party in the early 80s. Ford says the judge, who was 17 at the time, put his hand over her mouth when she tried to scream. She clearly considers this an attempted rape. She believes that if it were not for the severe intoxication of Brett Kavanaugh, she would have been raped. In his latest statement, Judge Kavanaugh says in part, quote, this is a completely false allegation. I have never done anything like what the accuser describes to her or to anyone. Some are calling Ford's recent allegations a political stunt aimed at preventing Kavanaugh from being confirmed to the Supreme Court. But Ford's attorney says no one would willingly bring this kind of attention upon themselves. No one in their right mind, regardless of their motive, would want to inject themselves into this process and face the kind of uh, annihilation that she will uh, be subjected to. Lawmakers on both sides of the aisle are calling for a delay in Kavanaugh's confirmation to allow for both Ford and Kavanaugh to testify. At the White House, Doug McKelway, Fox News.